what is happening guys welcome back to another video here at wicked garage behind me we have my 2008 chevy that i built the flatbed for um, just getting into the finishing touches of the wiring and you can see that the cab is all nice and shiny i debadged it took all the decals off and my buddy polished it and he did a killer job appreciate it man you killed it um before we get into this video Make sure you hit that subscribe button and like the video if you like what you see. Let's get into it, guys. finished results now i'm not a professional there is a few mistakes on here um you know i'm in a time crunch so i tried to do the best that i could with the experience that i've had i'm not a professional painter like i said so there is mistakes here and there um you know you can see run there or run up here and then um you know a few like thinner spots but I'm not going to be picky about it because I actually really like the way this came out and I'm actually going to be using it. So it's not like it's just going to be, you know, sitting on the back of the bed on a truck that goes in a garage every week, you know, and goes out one day a week or one every two weeks. Um, this wasn't meant to be a show truck build or anything like that. This is just pretty much a quick build for my truck to get a bed on it to get that back to my dad pretty much and um so he has a truck to use when he needs it um so i'm hoping to get the electrical and everything else done um in the next uh week or so so hopefully this weekend and I have to get a whole bunch of other stuff done like I mentioned previously you know the brake cables I got to get get done and then um you know the services and just check all the fluids and everything before I really go out and do anything and it has to go to an alignment shop so this is sort of like the final push um wiring's gonna be a little bit of a pain just because I did so many lights on the side but at night 
when the lights are on, they're gonna reflect and that thing's gonna light up like a giant light bar. Alright guys, quick little update here. Got the brake cable on, the new shocks on. I also filled the diff, did the oil change, did everything I needed, took all of these stickers and the emblems off, and then I had my buddy actually come and polish this up, which he killed it. This thing looks really good for what it is. Um, I had a ton of overspray on it. I had to help him a little bit on the hood to get all the... Um, the major like overspray. You can sort of see there's some remnants here and there. But I uh, touched that all the little spots up, got everything fixed, and um, pretty much he polished everything up, made it look nice, and gave it a quick little uh, spray on ceramic coat. So, really did a good job. And um, it's actually coming together now. So, I figured I polished this before I put the actual bed on. So, the actual bed is pretty much just about ready to go on. Um, everything's bolted on. The upper is all done. I have everything connected down below. And then uh, we have both sides in, but I still, I have this side wired, but I have to do some modification with the wiring because I use two small buck connectors. So we're gonna change those out. And then we're going to finish this side, get everything all situated, and then run all the wires for the strobes. And pretty much we should be good. Hopefully tomorrow, which is Saturday, we will have this going on the truck. Um, and have a buddy of mine help me get it on and sort of align it um, just so I don't hit anything. But it's getting there. We're just about done. We're in the finish line. And as soon as I get this all wired up in the morning, this will be up on the forklift and uh, that'll be interesting because I have to put some cardboard on the back to protect it and yeah. Mm -hmm. 